Welcome to the Drunken Progressive. Um, here's a idiot. He's not really an idiot, but he thinks we're stupid. So that's why he's saying stuff to trick us. Um, this is some... I don't even fucking want to learn his name. He's on some show talking some shit about Robin Hood and the Reddit people and the game stonks and all that shit. And he's all like... Uh... We're concerned about the poor people getting losing the monies. We care, even though they always make money, even the poorest don't make their money. Anyway, listen to this fucking piece of crap. All his shitty excuses, and he's so arrogant. I just love him, and he's such a cutie pie. Maybe you're learning here. Maybe it's fun. Fine. Maybe it's a movement. But be prepared to lose 80 to 90% of it, and if it's still worth it, then have at it. But the biggest loss of capital here will be the human capital of young men who are sitting and staring at their phone and watching the price of Bitcoin or the price of AMC. And ask yourself, would you be better off taking that one, two, or three hours a day and working out, trying to form relationships with mentors, <laughs> with, with, with romantic relationships, with people at work? No, nah, I'd rather fuck over the billionaires for three hours, please, the there, Chrome Dome. Trade. The greatest loss in, in capital here is is from young men who are more prone to gambling addiction, who don't understand uh, the markets. I think we are setting ourselves up similar to how there's a ton of young women out there who became very depressed by sitting in their rooms looking at Instagram, self-cutting and self-harm skyrocket. I think you are going to see uh, uh, an explosion in young male depression and i think a lot of it is going to be reverse engineered to apps that convince you you're part of a movement or physically addict you to your phone ask yourself would your time staring at robin hood be be better spent somewhere else that is the real capital destruction that is taking place here <laughs> what oh man they are fucking scared man the poor's figured out how to game the system, and uh, the 1% are fucking losing their fucking shit. L listen to him, just pretending like he gives a shit, like, I care about your well-being, and I don't want you to become an alcoholic and have a YouTube channel and stare at your phone. <sighs> Jesus Christ. What a fucking phony baloney. Ugh, I get why his hair left him. I wouldn't want to be on his head either. Good day, sir.